Welcome to FS17 Xbox One. Today we are live here with the landscaping crew. Today we will be uh, cutting firewood and we'll be loading it into the dump truck and also our single axle utility trailer. We've gotten lots of orders for firewood and we've had lots of wood at our lot drying out ready to go for the uh, winter season and with the start of fall uh, here it's good to uh, get the firewood deliveries out to our customers. We'll be making our way over to the shop here in our uh, Lizard Road Rage car. I really do like this lot here, especially this color scheme, which is pretty cool. I might kind of change this car up if you guys like. Maybe uh, white with the blue uh, stripes would be even cooler than this, but this should be a pretty long day for us. I think we'll start off with the single axle utility trailer. We'll get that loaded up and we'll do uh, possibly we'll do the delivery, but I want to just get all the wood kind of cut up into pieces. And we do not have a splitter with us here today. And uh, our customers are going to have to split the wood themselves. And uh, we already did let them know. Now, I'm very excited to be back here live on the Xbox One. I do have some pretty cool uh, videos to come here with the landscaping series. And you guys just saw a homeowner series up earlier on uh, today. So let me know your feedback with that. I do have some upgrades coming to that series as well. So I think we'll probably just put the Mustang over here and we'll get started off. Today's stream will not be in multiplayer uh, due to the fact that there's quite a bit of mods. But hopefully we can get the multiplayer series up and running. That would be pretty cool. Since this will be a very heavy load uh, with all of that wood, we'll hop here in our brand new dually pickup truck. This will pretty much be its kind of first shop, first time putting it to work. And that's going to be pretty cool. So we'll just get it backed up here to the trailer. And it is a small trailer, but... uh. Different clients want different amounts of wood, so it should be good. We will be doing shoutouts throughout the stream, and I do have some very cool things coming to the channel. Forza Horizon 4, I can't wait to do videos on that later on this a week, and other things like that as well, so stay tuned for those. We should be able to fill this trailer up no problem, which is awesome. I love the truck. Yes, this is one awesome truck. I really do enjoy interacting with all of you down below in the comments. Can I play? It's a closed multiplayer session, but we will be filling this trailer as much as we can. It is small, but it still can do the uh, trick. So you guys can see all this wood. We actually did do a job, a live stream with this. I do recommend you go check out that previous one. But this has been sitting here. It's drying out. You guys can see the bark's drying. Uh, and uh, that is perfect. We do not want wet wood because then it would not really burn too well. And we want our customers uh, to have very nice fires, keep their houses warm, everything like that. So we'll get out the uh, Husqvarna chainsaw and we'll get started off here. It looks like these keep moving back and forth which makes it a bit trickier can you make a truck dealership please i actually did do a gmc dealership along with a semi-truck dealership a ford and a dodge if you do have any cool questions anything drop it down below and uh, we'll interact as we do it homeowner uh package for the xbox one that actually sounds like a pretty interesting idea just maybe we might have to look into something like that uh you guys do give me some great feedback now i am using the elgato capture card hd uh, 60s this is the external one i do use uh both and uh, this computer right now has the external one it, it's time for some shouts so drop names down below shout goes out to charles austin Jesus, Jesus, Taurus, Brent, uh, Maxwell, Ryder, Eric, Creative, Brett. Uh, shout out to all of you guys stopping by and checking out uh, today's live stream. It's going to be a pretty exciting day, and we might not have enough to fill up the dump truck, but I think that we will. I mean, this trailer should be able to fill pretty quick as well. We are just nearing 80 viewers here for the stream now. That is pretty exciting. Uh, can you finish the compact tractors? I'm currently working on them. I want to get the train cut mower really sooner and uh, as fast as possible, so hopefully we can get them done. I do have a very busy school schedule as well which makes it a bit trickier as well shout out to miles Can I do more videos with my Subaru? Well, I actually have a very cool one coming soon. The Subaru is just close to 1,000 miles, so that will be pretty cool. Shout out goes out to Ryan and Gavin, Shayna, Jay, 
Shout out to all of you guys. I really do enjoy giving you guys shout outs and interacting with you guys live in a few more pieces. Probably another half piece will fill up this trailer now. This customer has a pretty small house and they uh, kind of order the wood as they go because sometimes they don't use more and sometimes they do and things like that. But we have just reached 93 viewers here on the stream. That's awesome. I appreciate all of you guys stopping by. It's going to be a long one though. We have all this wood to cut up and if we have time we will be doing the deliveries as well and that would be pretty cool now we will have to unload this one by hand and that's okay but we do charge a little bit more for that kind of get this one cut here compact tractors for the xbox would be pretty awesome uh shout out to bird blah patrick lee johnson shout out to all of you guys We'll pick this piece up, and a few more pieces will be good here, and we'll be, whoa, 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 and what we'll do for the big dump truck is we will just put these in the wheel loader, a bucket, and then we'll do that. No need to throw these up, break our backs to do that. I think we'll throw in a few small pieces as well. These will be good for kind of getting the fire started. Can I make an off-road course? That actually sounds like a pretty cool idea. We might have to look into uh, something like that. And I'd like to thank each and every one of you for all of the continued support here on the daily videos. It's a lot of fun to upload every single day. And you guys are making it possible, especially these Sunday streams. I really do enjoy streaming. And you guys really do make it enjoyable. And uh, it's what map are we on? We are on the Westbridge Hills map. So this is probably good. Actually, let's take a look up here. I think uh, probably this piece will be the last one we'll do. We'll throw this piece on. It's a little bit big, but that is okay. And a lot of you guys have been really liking the Homeowner series, which is pretty awesome. I can't wait to continue that series. More videos to come as well. And I do have some very interesting ideas, which should be awesome. So here we go, guys. We'll get this trailer strapped down. Only two straps, it looks like. Uh, some of that might be moving around on us, but that's okay. We'll kind of get this move forward here, and we're actually going to back it in here. We might not do the deliveries today. It really depends how much time we have but we'll get this backed in and kind of out of our way for now and please shout to Riley Vlogs and uh, do a police station and a sheriff station that sounds like a pretty cool idea I do recommend you check out my previous uh, police station videos we did actually build a police station but we also uh, set one up as well We'll get this out, and as you guys can see, I always just try to lock up the gates for added security as well. So we'll get this backed in, and this was actually in the thumbnail of today's uh, stream video, which was awesome as well. But let me know, guys. Let me know down below with a yes. Are you guys excited for Forza Horizon 4 content coming at the end of this week? That's going to be pretty awesome. They do have some uh, cool off-road toys, off-road trucks, everything like that that we will be doing. So let me know if you guys are excited for that. We will now be putting this brand new wheel loader to work. We could easily use our skid steer, but this is much easier, much more efficient. And I always do like being efficient. So we'll get all of them cut up and we'll throw them here in the bucket. We'll crawl the bucket just enough not too much because these are going to be pretty heavy pieces and we should be able to fill this bucket quite a lot do a fire rescue video i will be doing one within the coming days what map is this this is westbridge hills map all of these mods can be found down in the xbox uh or ps4 section of farming simulator on the main website Awesome, so we got this cut, which is nice. We'll come over here, and you guys can see just dropping them here in the bucket. It will be very efficient, and we should be able to fill up this truck, hopefully, uh, so or else we'll have to get more of this. We do have a few job sites where we will be getting more as well. Make a farming series. Well, well, I'm currently in the works on that. I'm trying to find a really good map. If you do have any cool maps, please let me know. But this farming series will be pretty realistic. Probably one of the best ones I've done on the channel, and that's going to be pretty exciting. I can't wait for it. I'm just trying to get all the last tractor mods, equipment mods, and everything ready to go for it. What tractors do you have in this series? 
I believe we do have a few old Massey Fergusons and a few others. Can I make a bowling alley? That sounds like a great idea. And I will be looking into Lone Oak. I would like uh, sort of it on a smaller side for a farm and a smaller map to make it a little bit easier since it's going to be a single player series. But if you do have any cool feedback, always let me know. Let's see, put a yes down below if you guys would like to be on Lone Oak. I've gotten a few comments about that. So let's see, would you guys like Lone Oak? We'll load up this bucket here. We will have to empty it here, not too uh, long from now. Probably after this one, yeah, it's going to be tight. So we'll just, I uh, know yeah, there's quite a bit of room. It, from the looks of it, guys, the dually that we actually used a little bit earlier today is only on Xbox, and that is a bit interesting. I was looking on the PC to even do a review on it because it's a very nice truck, and I can't find it. And if any of you have found it, please let me know. And the Family Farm map, I will look into that. And yeah, I was going to do a review for the PC, but couldn't find it. I did find like the new Lizard Dually style. I wish that that was on Xbox. That would be pretty awesome. We'll call up this bucket, and, and I think we'll just keep the little. Uh, loader on since we'll be doing these uh, Wiker farms that would be a very nice map and I really want to do a map that not too many others have uh, done video wise things like that but let's kind of see we should be able to crawl the bucket and that should be good and this is just so much easier than trying to throw these uh, pieces of wood in the bed and uh, let's kind of take a look at this here we go unloading them Looks like some of them really don't want to kind of come out, but they should all. Yeah, and there we go. Awesome. All of the mods you guys are seeing here in today's live stream are on the uh, PS4. These are console mods only. You can't bring a new brands to console, and that's kind of why you guys don't see Ford trucks, anything like that. RV dealership, that is an amazing idea. You guys might see that within the coming days, because that is going to be a pretty cool one. We'll have to do that, and we'll try to get this cut. Now we are just trying to chip away here at this pile. I'm not sure what exactly happened there. I went to cut this piece and there it goes. It, this piece kind of made a spawn there and there and we'll get that dropped. And I'm not sure what's happening here. It looks like uh, these are moving and then it's spawning us into the loader. That is a bit interesting. Haven't had that ever really happen to me in a while. Uh, make a tow truck for the Xbox One. Actually, uh, the truck that we are using, this dump truck, could technically become a tow truck with the uh, flatbed uh, piece on it. So you guys, go check out that. I actually did do a video setting up a repo shop. That was an awesome one. And I'm not sure what's happening here, guys. It looks like a control is a not aligning correctly and that almost went flying into our truck that would not have been good there let's see can we pick up this piece kind of just bring it out from the pile and having these things move around is also not uh, making it easy for us Let me know down below in the comments, guys, with a yes, should I get the brand new construction simulator too? I did check it out. It does look pretty cool. Let me know your feedback. We might just have to get that game. That would be a pretty awesome one. Let's see if we could put this here. And it is uh, uh, pretty cool. A lot, some of you guys would like it awesome. Yeah, so I will be getting it soon, and then I will do some pretty cool videos with that. And this should almost be pretty full bucket. Yeah, that's a good one. So, we'll hop back here in the loader. Let's try to do this one here in first first some view. Loaders, I think, are actually pretty easy to do this view in as well. And maybe I should have got, like, the in-game bucket. It would have made unloading a bit easier. What map is this? This is the Westbridge Hills map. All of these are official Xbox mods. That's the only way you could uh, kind of get mods is for them to be official and that's no problem. 
We'll get this unloaded in here. It looks like we will be able to have a full uh, truckload of wood, which is nice. I should only do a hay and dairy series. That actually sounds like a pretty interesting idea. Uh, I really do appreciate all of you guys for the feedback. It really does help improve the channel and everything like that. And... Whoa. Uh, I'm not sure exactly how I got over there. That's like this third or fourth time. Wow. Let's see. Did it cut? And no, it did not. So, we'll have to take a quick look at it. Continue to do snow plowing. A lot of you guys really did enjoy... Oh, I could actually see the lag there. So that must be it. A lot of you guys did enjoy the snow plowing series. So we might have to do just more of that. That might be what we'll do soon as well with some new plow trucks and uh, everything like that. And I'd just like to thank all of the mods for all their hard work releasing mods here for FS17. It's pretty awesome to be able to uh, use uh, great mods in the game. You are a great YouTuber. I really do appreciate it. I do put a lot of time here into my videos, and I also put time into getting mods ready for the videos as well, and maybe even putting my own touch to some mods, uh, changing the colors, changing the wheels, and even sometimes the beds. I really do enjoy everything about uh, making farming simulator videos on YouTube. Can I get a shout? Yes, let's do some more shoutouts. So shout goes out to NTG Landscaping, Mason, Brett, Sam, Charles, I can definitely see that there is quite a big a lag here in my game, and I believe it's because the Xbox kind of struggles here to kind of run some of the things, and the graphics aren't as good as the PC, especially with my awesome PC uh, running my game, but uh, it's still a nice uh, platform, and it's a very popular platform for gaming as well. Shout out to Maddie. Let me know what you guys think here of this landscaping series on the Xbox One. I think for FS19, we'll try to do lots and lots more of Xbox uh, videos. I think that Xbox, like I've touched upon, is an amazing platform, and a lot of you guys do use it as well. You guys can actually see that the wood is drying out, and that is what we need, and that is good. Is the game full? Currently, uh, the game is single player. I will be doing more multiplayer. That's also another goal of mine, is more and more multiplayer here for the channel. Channel and ones where you guys can join in. I can't wait to buy John Deere in FS19. That's going to be pretty cool. We don't have it for FS17, but FS19 we do, and that's going to be awesome. Just barely picking this up from falling, and it, it finally fell out. So uh, it looks like either way, just do not want to stay here in the truck, and we'll probably put that there. Wow, this loader is really, really handy. Instead of load, uh, throwing these in the uh, truck we are just using this shout out to matt uh connor raiden and maddie once again and i do appreciate all of you guys uh, stopping by and checking out the videos and this loader can't really reach too high as you guys can see which makes it a little bit trickier but rocking the bucket back and forth should have a few of these sliding out do a little bit of like backing up and harsh braking sometimes does it and there we go, so the final piece as well. We should be able to get a full truckload. Cutting firewood is a very long process here, but that's okay. I thought that this would be an awesome thing to do live here, especially being able to interact with you guys. I do spend lots of time, and I do put in a lot of effort to respond to just around 99% of all of you guys in the comments, which is also a lot of fun. So if you do have any cool comments, any feedback, anything, just drop it down below, and that is pretty cool. Can I make a mud runner map for FS17? More than likely, I will be kind of only working on the terrain cut and the compact tractors, and then uh, for FS19, I will be building a new map, and that should be pretty exciting as well. So we'll probably do a new map, uh, probably one with a lot of subdivisions, cool things like that, and I can't wait for that. The new, new 
everything about the game, the new graphics, it's going to be pretty exciting. Now this bucket here does have teeth. I really wish uh, we had the other bucket though with the extra reach on it. That probably would have come in a bit handy. Shoutouts will be coming a little bit later on throughout the stream. I've been giving shoutouts quite a lot, and that's awesome. I really do appreciate all of you guys stopping by these streams. And some of this wood looks to be drying out a bit faster than others. And it could be that some of these were buried, but wow, these last ones here are perfect firewood. They're really dry. They should be able to burn and not take too much for them to kind of get going. And like I've touched upon, guys, we already loaded up one small trailer load that a customer ordered. And now this is a big one here. It's actually for a big house as well. And they have uh, fires every night as well, which is pretty awesome. Can I do more real life videos? I do have a video coming on the 2018 demo WRX soon as well. And it looks like the chainsaw there was at a little bit of slant. Yes, I do have more landscaping videos to come here on the channel, even more uh, to do with the landscaping shop. I actually haven't done some in a very long time with that. I do apologize for that. Some other series are coming along as well, especially the new homeowner series. You guys have been giving great feedback, and I do have some very uh, interesting and exciting ideas for that series, so that should be awesome. And I can't wait to do those, and you guys can see uh, doing a great job. This loader bucket seems to be pretty much full. Probably one of the best ones we've done. So let's see if we could do it a little bit more. Get turned on and we'll unload this. Using a controller for uh, controlling uh, farm sim is pretty helpful, especially for turning. You could really control how the uh, game reacts, uh, steering, everything like that. And probably one more bucket and that should be good here for this truck. We don't want to fill it over to the top and wood can come out and one did fall out so we'll have to get that one as well uh, move the camera around here as you guys can see it is tilted quite a bit having that tilt uh, makes it so we have to lift it higher things like that so I don't really want to lift it here I think at the end of today let's unload just this one the other one's going to take a very long time let's see can we throw it in and first try, that's pretty cool. You have to stay a little bit uh, further away when you want to throw it up, but that should be good. We'll cut up a few more of these, probably one last bucket, and whoa, we'll go do a delivery. Actually, no, this one's uh, cut up, so uh, do this. I do not have a uh, switch. Let me know how you guys are enjoying these Sunday streams. Do you guys like them better? And how's the timing? Everything like that. We did actually move the timing and things like that. But I think that it's a lot better here for the channel uh, time-wise. It's a little bit later on in the day. And it is on a Sunday. So everybody has a bit more time as well. Which is pretty cool. And I hope all of you guys do have a great start to the school week. And I hope all of you guys do have an amazing week as well. It's going to be a pretty exciting one. Forza Horizon 4 comes out at the end of the week so pretty cool videos coming with that related to the trucks and everything like that This will more than likely be our last bucket here. It's actually been a pretty long day. Just around 25 minutes here, which is pretty awesome. And we've been averaging just around uh, 60 uh, 
anywhere between 60 to 90 uh, viewers throughout the stream, which is also very exciting. I really do appreciate all of you guys supporting these streams. I can't wait to do more, and we will be live uh maybe on Friday. Let me know, guys. Would you guys like me to do a live stream for Forza? I would definitely let you guys know. I think that that would be awesome if you guys would like. Let's see if we could put a few more here in the bucket since this will be the last one. Did we cut this one? Nope. Uh, this looks to be the last piece. Try to put this here. And, oh, there we go. A full bucket. Perfect. This will be the last one here. And I think for time-wise, we more than likely will have to do the delivery here off-camera. But wow, it has been a very exciting day. We'll probably head back to the house and grab some lunch. That should be a really good thing for us to do. So we'll just come over here and let's uh, unload this here. The truck is definitely going to be full. Hopefully, those don't fall out. Trying to be as careful as I can to not have some of those go over the edge and almost two on two. Hopefully they don't. And there you guys have it. A uh, nice full truck load. We'll have to watch the house that, uh, that shelter there and we'll get this back in. More public works. Yes, that is one thing I've been thinking about doing more of as well. I haven't done too much of that and definitely would like to. We got the loader all parked up there. It looks like one to two pieces have fallen out and that should be okay. I will do this uh, early Monday morning and especially nobody wants us to show up at 7, uh, 7.30 p.m. at night. And uh, especially on a Sunday, they want to rest, watch football, watch all the different sports and even some racing, cool things like that. Is there any new mods for the Xbox other than like the Lizard Dually? I don't think there's been too much of them. And maybe I pushed that in. Maybe it fell out. Nope, it fell out, but that's okay. This actually doesn't have straps, which makes it a bit trickier, but we'll try to throw it in. And almost there. Almost. It's, it's a little bit like basketball, but a little bit easier as well. So that looks good there. The truck is fully loaded. I'm not sure if there are straps. We'll give it a try. There aren't any, so we'll have to drive a little bit slower. But that's been a pretty awesome stream. Pretty full. I might try to do like another load or two in it bucket-wise. Yeah, I might do that. And uh, we'll have to see what that is. But as you guys can see, today was a very successful day here on our Sunday. Let me know down below if you guys enjoyed today's stream. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And subscribe for more.